look at the July peak, which occurred two weeks after the end of the second quarter, and that was the high internally for the MAG7 style stocks. That was the internal peak there right in July of this year. You can see there that had the momentum to carry for a couple more weeks into the new quarter. And then you just had a very, very important automatic reaction decline occur after that on very heavy volume. So the end of the quarter brought supply in in a very big way at the beginning of the third quarter. And now look at what we have. We have an a market that has rallied up into the end of September and it is rallied to a new high at the end of the quarter. And I wonder if that doesn't mean that we're going to get some kind of a correction, which Ramon actually just talked about earlier in a, in a prior slide. 